Ladies and gentlemen, after one of the best fights we have seen here at Cage Titans, keep the noise going for these two absolute warriors. <laughs> Referee Alan Lau has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 53 seconds of round number three, giving you your winner by TKO, Slippery Pete, Peter Barrett. I'm here with your winner, Slippery Pete Barrett. My friend, 15th pro win. That is easily one of the greatest fights that's ever graced this cage here. What is, what's going through your head in some of those exchanges, wild exchanges that were happening? You know, I was just having a good old time, man. I was a little sloppier today than normal, uh, but that's cool. I still pulled out on top. I'm a dog. I got the dog in me. I know how to fucking fight. Um, obviously, my game plan was a little slicker than that. It just, I had too much fun trading blows with him. You know, we talked a lot of shit coming into the fight, but uh, I don't know, he's probably upstairs. It was really just to sell this fight. I knew he was gonna bring it. I wanted to make sure the fans were as excited as I was, and I'm just trying to light that fire under my ass. The more shit I talk, the harder I have to fight, so I was just making sure I showed up. Absolutely, dude, you absolutely showed up. What's it? Make the call. What do you, what do you, I know what you want, but what do you see? The fucking UFC, baby, send me back. Send me back, send me back. Let's call Dana. I know he's in London, but fuck around. Let's go, find out. Dana White knows he'll be getting violence from Slippery Pete. Keep it going for your winner, Slippery Pete, but one more. Hey, real quick, I know most of you guys love me and a good portion of you all hate me too, but real quick, I'm having a son in August. The second generation of highly calculated violence is in the fucking building tonight, and, and I got engaged, so round of applause for my fiance.